seemed like a bit of a grind at times for James Paxton. What did you think of his outing? I, I thought it was all right. Um, you know, fastball was in that kind of 92 to 94 range. Uh, so, you know, which first time in a real competitive environment, he's faced hitters, obviously, and pitched in some bullpens, but to get a little bit of a, a little more of a, a push up and some in competition, I thought overall uh, pretty good. I thought he made a lot of good pitches. I, I do think he made some mistakes uh, in the middle of the plate with some of his pitches, but, um, you know, got his pitch count up. Um, so I thought overall a positive step. I think, you know, he wishes he would have been a little sharper, um, but I thought a pretty good step overall. You seem pretty optimistic overall when it was when it came to Aaron Judge's neck issue. Still, do you breathe a sigh of relief when you see him step into the batter's box and go deep and stay in the rest of the game? Um, uh, yeah, I'm sure. Um, but but yeah, I, I felt like it was going to be something that was going to be a couple of day. You know, I, I've kind of been there in the course of the season where I, you know, your neck kind of gets jammed up on you and it's. You know, it, you can kind of fight through it and sometimes leads to some bad habits and stuff. But I was confident that, he, especially the way he was progressing each day, um, that, he, that he would get to this point. But, yeah, it's always nice to see the big fella go out the front door. What stood out to you about Luizaga today? Efficient. I mean, just, you know, I mean, <clears throat> he, he, he can overwhelm you with his stuff and – uh you know, he did that today. You know, we were going to go three innings with him, maybe 45 to 50 pitches. He was three innings, I think, I think he only threw 33 pitches. So he was just really efficient with his stuff, uh, real aggressive with his fastball. Um, I almost sent him out for a fourth inning just to ramp it up, but I just felt like the three ups today was plenty. And because uh, he'll, he'll, he'll go back again on three days rest. Um, uh I believe, yeah. So Sunday, uh, at home against the Mets, he'll he'll be back out there for a few probably. So, um, I, I thought I thought he was really good. Thank you, Ron mm -hmm. Blum. Go ahead and unmute. Do you evaluate these intra squad games the same way you would evaluate uh, spring training games, or? If you factor it differently and look for different things, what are you seeing? Right. Um, I, there's at least some similarities. Um, you know, I mean, this is this is competition. It's obviously unique and different, and no fans, and you're playing against your own guys. But but I think everyone understands the importance of it and the urgency of it. You know, especially in a condensed version of three weeks. I think all the hitters you know, understand the importance of getting their at-bats, of, of getting their defensive reps, pitchers, same thing, you know, whether it's building a pitch count, whether it's with some of our relievers today going back-to-back -back for the first time. Um, you know, th these things, th these times are incredibly important. So, uh, you know, yeah, I do think you're making some evaluations that are, that are, that are akin to what you would do in spring. Marley Rivera, go ahead. Hey, Aaron, does it excite, even though it's a, it's a quote-unquote summer camp game and seeing what Giancarlo and Aaron did today, is that the kind of thing that excites you of the kind of power that this team can bring, even if it's a 60-game season? Sure. I mean, those guys in there, you know, healthy and posting, you know, obviously we feel like they're going to do a lot of damage. And, uh, you know, hopefully they can go out there and, and do what we all know they're capable of. And so to see them, you know, do that a little, you know, a little weird when you're, you're watching your guy work on the mound too and want him to get his work and, and things like that. But, um, you know, it's good to see, you know, the, the competition um, that is existing out there. I think, you know, especially, you know, the, the guys with the track record are, are using it, um, to try and get themselves ready for next week. Um, but, but you also, I feel like see the competitive juices come out in these guys, um, and wanting to do well against one another. That's precisely my follow up was in terms of that. How do you evaluate it when you are actually looking also at your pitcher and then seeing how your hitters are performing? How, how do you strike that balance, Aaron? 
I, I strike it with, you know, come on, G, you two packs. <laughs> You know, I mean, I mean, you know, and, and in, in the case of Giancarlo, you know, I thought he hit a pretty good pitch. You know, it looked like it was, you know, I, I haven't seen it back, but it looked like a fastball in the inside corner that Giancarlo just did a really g good job of getting the barrel to and being able to keep fair. So, um, you know, you just want to watch them compete and, and find that um, good competitive level to where they're, you know, resembling who they're going to be. Thank you. Mm hmm Sweeney Murdy, go ahead. Aaron, as important as Judge, Stanton, and Sanchez are to your lineup, you're eight days away. How much work do you want them to get in the next, you know, in the next week here leading up to the opener? Quite a bit. Um, you know, those got, you know, we've we've gotten to go back to back with them, you know, with, with also building in the, the recovery days. Um, you know, we've pushed their innings up. They've, they've played seven innings now a couple of times, which I think is important. Um, you know, Gary's gone back to back. I think he went six or seven yesterday or caught six yesterday and then four more today. You know, those kind of things and kind of building up their endurance and ability to bounce back. Um, you know, that's important moving forward. So we'll have a lighter day tomorrow, obviously, with no inner squad, just some live at bats for some guys. Um, and then Fridays, you know, we're treating as a game. We're going Friday night. Uh, we got quite a few innings out there, and then obviously three exhibition games. So, you know, we'll push them in some of them, back off in some others, but the but the back-to-back -back reps will also be important. 